I love every single highlight that I'm about to show you guys because it shows that the Chicago Bears are on their way, and DJ Moore clearly knows that as well. Good high energy out of this guy who's going to completely change the Chicago Bears offense. And he's also going to change the relationship of Justin Fields and this offense as a whole. Fields, obviously, this year looks a ton different. He loves playing in Luke Getze's offense. He loves playing with DJ Moore. These guys are just working right now. You can see on a short slant route at Family Fest, he did absolutely fantastic. And then on top of it, Fields to Moore in the end zone, just threading the needle, looked fantastic. This duo is going to be super dangerous for years to come. And especially also with the deep ball, Fields was able to find more so many times on deep balls. And then uh, Moore just absolutely was able to bring it in. Corner route, end zone, absolutely no problem for Moore. This guy's going to be a touchdown machine. Go to Darnell Mooney, who absolutely turned it up at practice this week. He looks 100% that he's ready to go, and that's great with the Chase Claypool injury. Mooney was cooking defenders all day right here on Kyler Gordon, who also had a big week. But Mooney looks 100%, looks strong, looks fast, and I'm so excited about it. He's going to bring that deep ball ability, as you can see right here against Josh Blackwell. Great coverage, but better one-handed catch by Mooney. He looked absolutely unstoppable. And then here, you know, Chase Claypool is going to be a big problem too. Justin Fields, a Chase Claypool, big body wide receiver in the end zone, going to be awesome. Speaking of big bodies, you know, Cole Komet, Robert Tunyon had some night catches too. They look like they're super involved in this offense, and I'm really excited about it. But the number one thing that I want fans not to forget about is the tuck and run by Fields. Expect a lot of from this from Fields this year as he is an elusive quarterback and then also trick plays you know right there running it but also the flea flicker and then running it to the outside too another flea flicker opportunity where field has to use his feet quickly want to go to another star yana nagakwe got really up to speed quick with the chicago bears this video is in slow motion by the way and look how fast he is i am so happy about this signing guys and also another guy i'm super excited about is jalen johnson Jalen Johnson is in a contract year, no picks last year, struggled with his health, but he looks 100% in back, and he's got a chip on his shoulder that he wants to do well for the Chicago Bears team. I'm really excited about him. All these angles, just so beautiful, and I cannot wait for Jalen Johnson this upcoming season. I hope we extend him and give him a nice contract to stay home in Chicago. Another thing I liked at camp was that everyone, including the receivers, tight ends, running backs, and quarterbacks, were doing these drills where they were protecting the football. Here's Chase Claypool. But I like that because ball security is so important to this team. And then Noah Sowell, I think, is also going to be a problem. He's going to be a tackling machine. Just want to put that out there for you guys. Bellas Jones Jr. looked really good in all special teams drills. I'm excited for him this year. He earned the job. So I just put this highlight in first. there because this guy just Which sounds like an absolute Which of the quarterbacks in the NFC North do you that. expect to have the best upcoming season. Jordan loves Shea, and here's why. The quarterback is a developmental position. If we go back to the Super Bowl, Patrick Mahomes and Jalen Hurts, two heavyweights just fighting it out to win a championship. Neither one of them started from day one. Patrick Mahomes, even though Kansas City traded up for him, started one game, and we know Jalen Hurts was a second. But that's all the highlights that I have for you guys today. Thanks for tuning in to this highlight episode from Just Another Year Chicago. Thanks for everybody who took videos as well, and thanks for the Chicago Bears for posting them. But with that, thank you very much for joining this episode of Just Another Year Chicago. My name is Nick Brody, and we'll see you guys next time.